Talk about the ultimate test of endurance. A woman from Texas is harnessing science and determination to try to accomplish the impossible. Hold on to your seats for this one. Here's Teresa Woodard. 22,615 feet, summit of Ojo de Salado. Roxanne Vogel is adventure. Yeah, Oscar. She's behind the camera here, the one who is breathless, cheering on a fellow climber crossing a cable suspended 16,000 feet in the air, which she had just crossed herself. There are two things I really love, and science is one, and mountains is the other. She's climbed five of the seven tallest summits in the world and completed 50 mile races high in the mountains. But this graduate of Texas Woman's University is about to test her body like never before, doing in two weeks what takes the most skilled climbers one or two months. Leave home, climb Mount Everest and come back safe. That's sea level to 29,029 feet back to sea level in 14 days. It's believed it will be a world record. Yeah, that's why I just really want to see if it, it can be done. I Skyped with Roxanne from California, where she now lives, to understand how this is physically possible. The air at the altitude of these summits is thin, taking days or weeks to adjust. But Roxanne has been training for months, sleeping in a special high-altitude tent. And as Roxy Mountain Girl on Instagram, she's filmed herself working and exercising in an altitude chamber. I've taken meetings in there and people are like, oh, I feel a little woozy. <laughs> her TWU degree landed her a job at a company that specializes in nutrition for athletes. On her trek, she'll track how her body reacts. That research could help other athletes, adventurers, and even those of us who aren't better understand the link between what we eat and how we perform. Yeah, I'm nervous about what I can't control, but at the end of the day, you can't control that. And so to worry about it is, you know, kind of fruitless. Less than 10% of the people who've successfully summited Everest are women. It seems almost certain that Roxy Mountain Girl is about to be among them. In Dallas, I'm Teresa Woodard.